Uh, did you report the incident of Mitch threatening Stacy and the baby? What, to Commissioner Lowell? The guy who put Mitch back out on the street? The guy who, as mayor, had Star and her baby kidnapped to cover up his involvement in a drug ring? Uh, okay, there has to be something we can do. <sighs> Mitch is denying it, and there's no proof that he did anything except Stacy's word. And are you sure you can trust her? Don't even think about opening your mouth about the baby unless you want to lose Gigi. Miss Stacy, would you listen? No, you listen to me, okay? Forget about Mitch, forget about me, and most of all, forget about the baby. Well, how am I supposed to do that, Stacy, when the baby you're carrying isn't even Rex's? It's mine. What are you doing here, lab boy? I, I, I just came to get a patient's chart. I, I didn't know anybody was in here. What did you hear? I'm just going to get the chart and go. Yeah, you must have heard something. You were in the room when Skylar shot his mouth off, so what'd you hear? Fine. Okay, I, I heard that Rex Balsam isn't the father of your baby. He is. <laughs> All I meant by that was that, that Stacy and I go way back. We used to be a, a, a thing, so obviously I'm going to feel, you know, some kind of paternity. Okay, come on, dude. Seriously? You're, you're a phenomenally crappy liar, okay? You should take some lessons from your ex here. Okay, listen, now that you know, you can't ever tell anyone. Stacy has been a lying machine in the past, but I'm positive she didn't make this up. Mitch and this nurse definitely tried to drug her and take her off somewhere so that they could get the baby. Uh, okay, well, uh, well, then why don't we go inside and we can take it from the top. Lexi, why were you here with this guy in the first place? Or we can just talk out here. Ranting about wanting me and my child to join him and his brainwashed followers. Well, are you sure he wasn't talking about uh, Shane? Yeah. For some reason, he is obsessed with my unborn child with Stacy. Jessica has already gotten extra security at her house, especially around her daughter, Bree. She's also got Brody to help keep her safe. Okay, so you want someone to protect Stacy and the baby? Exactly. Well, did, did Mitch mention why he was so keen on taking the baby? Yeah, he's, he's planning for the future of his so-called church. But my kid and I aren't going to be in it. You're all looking versed. Look, Rex, I want to help you, but Kyle and I barely get to see each other as it is, and if I take another job... Look, look Fish, I, I wouldn't be asking if this were not the real deal. Mitch is serious. He and this nurse came after Stacy, and they will try it again if I do not help protect her and the baby. Okay, I'll ask around the station, and maybe one of the guys needs a gig who... I don't know the other guys, except for Brody, okay? And now this new commissioner is totally corrupt and in Mitch's pocket. I can't afford to trust any of them. Bo and John trust you, therefore I trust you. I would feel a lot better if it was you looking out after Stacy. Please, Fish, you would not hesitate if it were your baby in harm's way. My life is riding on this, and so is Skye's. You're still trying to do whatever you can to get Rex Balsam to pay attention to you, huh? Blake, you don't know what that's like? Up in Fish's face every two seconds until he finally agreed to be your boyfriend? I'm actually in love. Yeah, and you're also about to be a mother. How much does it suck for that kid that you're carrying that you're already lying about its identity? And then that, that its father can't man up to his responsibility. Are you really getting on your moral high horse after everything you've done? You switched blood records. You blackmailed Natalie. I did that for you, Stacy. Okay, and I'm not happy with what I did. But I've moved on now, and that was then, and this is now. And I got my life back on track, and I know what's important. So, Kyle... Are you saying you're going to tell Rex the truth? Uh, I guess I could put in some hours when my shift is over. You're a lifesaver. But that only covers part of the day. What are you going to do the rest of the time? Well, when you're not watching her, I'm sticking to Stacy like glue. Everything is finally going my way. You're not going to ruin this for me. I don't even know what this is, Stacy. The only thing you need to know is you found it out because you're almost a doctor, okay? And it also means you can't run your yap to Rex or anybody else. But I know Rex, and his mother is a really good friend of mine. This is wrong. Well, she's right, Kyle. You're in med school. Just like me, you have no choice but to keep your mouth shut. Kid, I, I never said I was going to rat you out, okay? Uh, yes, but you didn't say that you wouldn't. You are skating on thin ice in med school already, Kyle, and you know they're going to give you the boot if you just do something stupid like compromising a patient's privacy. I back the hell up, Jeff. Well, all I'm saying... I said back the hell up! Okay. All right. What, what, what happened to you, man? You used to be like a, a pretty stand-up guy, right? You know, you know what? Whatever you guys are into, I don't want any part of it, Okay. This kid, this kid 
keeps getting bigger and bigger, doesn't it? I don't trust him. After everything I put him through last year, what if he still has it in for me? If he goes to Rex, you and Gigi are over. My sister will never forgive you if she finds out you knew the truth and you kept it from her. You're not. I'll go tell you, Kyle. Oh, kiddo, it's gonna be okay. Don't worry, I'm not gonna let anybody get in our way. We're gonna be a family. You, me, and Rex. I think... I got nothing to say to you, Jocelyn. Look, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I came on so strong back there, okay? It's not what you think. I didn't... I didn't sleep with Stacey willingly. <laughs> right. She drugged me, okay? Drugged you? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, she drugged me because she wanted to get herself knocked up again. Why? Okay, she lost Rex's baby. She had a miscarriage early on in the first trimester. Next thing I know, she's trying to replace that kid because without it, she loses her connection to Rex. Okay. Yeah, that's that's tragic. But why would you go along with that line? I, I, it's, it, it, it's complicated. I know it sounds crazy, but I, I'm telling you, it's true. You know what? I, I, I believe you. You do? Yeah. Stacy came on to me, too. Big time, and now I finally know why. Good thing I'm gay and turned it down flat. Okay, Rex, I'm, uh, I'm going to do everything I can to make sure that Stacy is safe for the rest of her pregnancy. And the baby, too, when it's born. I will I'll protect it like it's my own. I don't, I don't even remember having sex with Stacy. That's how drugged I was. And by the time I figured out that the kid was even mine, Stacy was already trying to pass it off as Rex's. Now, I... I, I uh, uh, Kyle, I know this is a, this I, I, is a cr I gotta I gotta take this. I'm sorry. Hey, Oliver, uh, kind of in the middle of something right now. Hey, when do you get off work? Uh, soon. What's up? I uh, I need to run something by you. Okay, I'll stop by when I'm done. Okay, I'll uh, I'll see you then. Okay, I, I I know this is a crazy situation. It's, it's it's your business. Okay, to be honest, I I could care less why you're going along with Stacy's lie, but I'm happy in my life for a change. So whatever you or Stacy or anybody else does, it's up to you. I'm not gonna tell anybody. Really? Yeah. Thanks. Okay, so we don't have to worry about Kyle anymore. He's not gonna say anything. But what about Rich? Uh, what, what about him? Just, just because I'm not claiming this child doesn't mean I don't care if a madman comes and steals him. It's not bad enough you stole Gigi. What are you doing here hanging around Stacy, my baby? I'm in med school now. Some days the hospital is our classroom. Like you should be allowed back into any classroom. Although at least the students you hit on be out of high school. I'll give up the rest. You ready? Yeah, I, I just got to make sure I didn't forget anything. I'll pull the car around. Okay. Oh, uh, did you check into that extra security to make sure me and the baby are safe? Uh, yeah, it's all set. I hired a cop to watch you when I can. God, you're the best. Be outside in five? You got it. Uh, you are a sight for sore eyes. <laughs> Not that I don't appreciate the royal treatment, but what's up? I, um, I just wanted to tell you that I'm sorry. Okay, what's what's wrong? What's up? I'm going to be pretty busy over the next month or so. I, I'm moonlighting doing a job for Rex. Rex Balsam? Yeah, uh, Mitch Lawrence is after Rex's baby. See? The baby's well protected. You satisfied now? Yeah. Relieved is more like it. You and the baby are safe, and Kyle's not gonna tell anybody the baby's in Rex's. Kyle, tell me, what is it? What's wrong? Deliver me.